Ah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video, where today, I am in my medieval city! It's so amazing, there's literally like, pretty much floating islands everywhere, and I'm about to enter my city, where today, I have some special things to show you guys. It's gonna be so cool, but um, today we're gonna focus on staying around the bottom, because we have some crazy little mobs to show you guys. Look at all these mobs. We have a total of nine, 18 and 27 different types. I can't believe we have so many different things, but it's gonna be so cool once we get started I do want to show you guys every single one of these so I'm gonna pretty much get out nine different random ones So I will just go through them as we go along and hopefully it can be a decent amount I want to start off by populating the front area of our city is to scare anyone that comes near us the first mob we have is the Panther. It's a crazy little lion, which comes in different sizes and different colors and everything. Come on, where is the different type? Oh wait, it's a different spawner. I'll show you guys later what the other one looks like. But it's going to be so cool once we get started today, because these are some crazy little stuff. Whoa, I do love it that they follow the mama. Look at them. Oh, they're so cute. They're following the mama. Oh, so nice. All right, I'll stay back. Don't worry, protect your babies. And next up, we have the deer. Oh, look at them. So cute. Oh, so nice. I'm guessing these lions or these pangas are going to start attacking the deers, which I'm really scared about. It's going to be a huge, huge fight. And once again, they deers follow the mummy. Oh, so cute. All right, I'm kind of scared though. I don't want anyone to die, so I'm really scared about this. I do want to probably go ahead and spawn some more round here. We have a panther. Whoa, look at these things. Wow. They look so scary. Whoa. And I do love it that when they kind of like roar, their mouths open up and they show their vicious teeth. It's so scary. Whoa. Honestly, these are so bad. And I'm kind of scared of for the deers. Deers, it's okay. I'm going to spawn a liger. Hopefully, it's not a dangerous creature. Three, two, one. Oh no, it's a liger. This is not good for the deers. This is not good at all. Whoa, look at those teeth. They look so scary. Guys. Back off, back off, don't go near me, don't go near me, okay, I am, I created you guys, so please, stay, <laughs> stay close by, don't do anything too crazy, okay, oh, this is going to be mental, let's also go ahead and spawn some raccoons, which I want to spawn, where, sh where should I spawn them, oh wait, the raccoons live in forests, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go right to the entrance, and pretty much spawn them at the entrance, because that's going to be so cool, once we spawn them. So, raccoons, where do they normally live? I think they kind of live in like forests and stuff. So hopefully this should be a great spot right in here. Raccoon and raccoon. Whoa, so nice. Once again, loads of little baby ones flying around. Oh, so cute. Whoa, hopefully he's hiding. So hopefully um, one of these pangas don't go ahead and attack it. So that's what I'm really worried about. We also have some small mouses, which are really cute. Coming about three different colors, I think. There you go. Whoa, really cool, which is perfect food for these <laughs> dangerous creatures. I mean, stay away, mouse. Stay away. I don't want anyone to die. Oh, man, this is not good. I can kind of see them ready to hunt. All right, stay back. Well, it's time now to pretty much go ahead and spawn some crocodiles, which for this, we have to be near the water. We can't obviously spawn them away from water, which is going to be so crazy bad. But let's go ahead and spawn them on the beach. So three, two, one. Whoa! Nice! <gasps> oh, gosh, he's snapping! He's snapping at me. This is not good. Whoa, look at that! Stay back, get to your water, get to your water. Whoa, he's snapping again. This is not good. Wow, these are so scary. And I also want to spawn a panda bear, which is kind of cool, I guess, but wh where, where are they supposed to be spawned around here? I'm guessing I'm just going to have to spawn it near the flowers. There you go. Ah. You know, pandas used to be my favorite animal. Now I don't know what my favorite animals are. But thankfully, I've spawned them here where there's some bamboo over there. So they have to travel a little bit. Don't be lazy, guys. Bamboo is just over there. Actually, oh, no, look how cute. He's sitting down. Oh, so cute. He's probably like, I am not moving. I want the bamboo over here. I do not want to go over there. Well, you're going to have to be stubborn then because you won't eat if you don't go over there. All right. And I also want to spawn some giant elephants. Whoa! 
Look at these things. Wow. So big. They were absolutely huge. And look at their trunks and everything. I'm guessing these are going to get very thirsty soon. So there is some water over there for them to drink. Which is going to be so crazy. But I still have so many more things to show you guys. Let me go ahead and get out the rest of our spawners. Before we pretty much get inundated with mobs. So I'm going to chuck these into my inventory. Good, good, good. Perfect. And let me go ahead and pretty much get out another nine. I'm going to get out the ostrich, the fox, the panther, the duck, polar bear, uh, leopard, kitty, komodo dragon. Nice. And also the ant. And I'll come back in a minute and do the rest, I guess, which is going to be so cool. The ants are so amazing, which I'm going to spawn them right here at the entrance. Look at these things. They come in different little wood colors and everything. Like, whoa, they're just so big. Look at them. They are so scary. It's like being in Lord of the Rings or something. Wow. These ones really blend in well with the trees around it. These are amazing. I wonder what other type of trees we can spawn. Same. Same. Now, I have been told you have to be in different environments to spawn different types. So maybe these are the ones that spawn in this environment. Whoa. They're huge. Well, that's not so bad. Let me go ahead and also spawn some Komodo dragons, which are really cool creatures. Which I'm guessing is going to try and kill the deers. There you go, dear. Off you go. He's, there you go. Good. He's made it past the barrier. Oh, hopefully he's fine with his mummy. Well, the mouse is taking a risk there, which is kind of cool. Well, the Komodo dragons are cool, but look how lazy they are. <laughs> they kind of get flat on the ground when they want to heat up, which is so cool. But I do want to also go ahead and spawn the kitty cats. Oh, so cute. These can be perfect pets. Oh, these are so nice. Well, guys, tell me down below in the commentary area which one is your favorite so far. I'd really, really, really like to know. It would be so cool to know. Maybe you've had the, sa the same one as me. It would be amazing. My favorite ones so far are the Ents. So comment down below which one is your favorite so far, and we'll do it again before we finish the video. Let's also go ahead and spawn the Leopard. Whoa! <gasps> wow, these are huge. I'm just surprised no one is killing each other yet. This is just amazing. Whoa. Okay, well next up, I'm going to do the polar bears. Wow! Once again, we don't have a place to spawn the polar bears, but I'm guessing they're going to have to be happy right here. <gasps> Wait, I think something just died. Did you guys see it? Look, there you go! It's killing the kitty cats! It's poisoned them! Whoa! Oh no! Oh, poor kitty cats. That's not good. Oh man. It is true though that the Komodo dragons do have a poison on them, which is very dangerous. That kills the creatures they attack very, very slowly. Oh, such a shame. Let's also go ahead and spawn and near the water our favorite ducks. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> Whoa, so cool. I do wonder what happens when you push them on water. There you go. They look like chickens. These are chickens. Wait, these are different colored type of chickens. That's crazy. Well, I'm guessing they're going to have to have a dangerous time with the panthers nearby. Whoa, really nice. And also some foxes. These are so cool, these foxes. They're like one of my favorite creatures in the whole world. Look at them. Oh, they're so cute. We have so many foxes in England. Do you guys have foxes where you are? Tell me down below if you have any foxes. It'll be so weird to know. And let's also go ahead and spawn the ostrich, which is probably only habitable to Australia or something. I don't really know, but that would be so weird. Wow, that looks like a turkey or something. <laughs> There's so much variety on these ones. It's so cool. But before we finish, we still have nine more to go through, which is going to be so cool, which I want to show you guys the different types we have before we finish. So let's go ahead and get out the last nine. Which are going to be, whoops, let's put these in there. Good, good, good. Great. And let's get out the last nine. So we have the goat, the lion, the tiger, the lyard, the mole, the snake, the grizzly bear, the le leoga, leoga, and also the litha. Whoa, nice. And before it gets dark, we should probably change the darkness to probably sunlight again. Just so we have enough sunlight to last for these last nine mobs. Let's go ahead and spawn the Lythers. Whoa. Crazy stuff. <gasps> these are so dangerous. Whoa, stay back. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> They're still there. It's staring at me. I'm out. I'm out. Go, 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 go. Quickly. <gasps> the pig. He probably won't survive the pig. But let's go ahead and spawn Leogas. Whoa. Wow, these are dangerous. Not very nice at all. And let's also spawn some grizzly bears, which will probably go along with the polar bears so nicely. Oh, wow, these are so cute. 
There were a lot of dangerous animals on here, to be honest. And I'm scared the pig's gonna die! Grizzly bear! He, can you hear him chewing? Listen. Whoa, they're fighting! There you go, a huge fight is lifting off. Who's gonna win? I think the grizzly bear will win. <gasps> I was wrong! Whoa, there you go! Look at this! Wow! Will the mama protect his baby cubs? Let's see what happens. Are they gonna fight or not? I'm gonna spawn some snakes as we whilst we wait. And look at these things. They come in hundreds and hundreds of different colors. <gasps> wow! They're so dangerous. Wow, honestly, I do not want to get involved right now. And we also have some crazy moles that hide underground. There you go. There he is. Come on, there. Let's go and get him. There he is. <laughs> hey, oh, sorry. Ah, oh, poor creature. Directly he touches, like, grass and stuff, he will hide. So let's wait a few seconds. Let's see what happens. Whoa. Look, they're attacking again. Whoa. Calm down, guys. And let's see what the mole happens when he touches some dirt. Let's see. Here it goes. There you go. He's gone. And let's also spawn some Lyards. Nice. Whoa. They all look very similar, but just different types and different colors. Wow. The snakes are slowly dying. Whoa, look. Whoa, guys, calm down. Ah, oh, no. This is not good. This is so bad. And let's also spawn some tigers. Whoa. Crazy. Actually, I love tigers. From the second lot, guys, which one's your favorite so far? Let's spawn some lions real quick. And also some goats. Oh, no. <laughs> this is not good. This is going to be a huge eating fest for them all. Whoa. So out of the second lot, definitely the tigers is my favorite. Whoa. Out of the second lot, guys, which one is your favorite? Tell me down below, and I'd really like to find out. Well, guys, we have finished. We have done a total of 27 different types of mobs today. Well, guys, I'll show you guys the rest of them in episode number two, which should hopefully be out tomorrow around the same time. So, guys, I'll see you all tomorrow with another video. Peace out.